Suck up. I don't know what this game is. I saw a clip about it. You can hear your mic. You can talk shit to people. You're a vampire. And the only way you can, like, suck their blood is if you... You're kind, and they let you in your house. And then you can attack them. That's what the game is, alright? That's what it is. You riz up your neighbors. You let get in their house, and you give them a little hickeys here and there. You know what I'm saying? That's what the game is, and that's what we're gonna do. Because I have nothing else to record, and all my friends hate me. Let's get straight into it, man. Suck the shit out of these people, man. I'm gonna suck them dry, man. I'm gonna suck their dicks. <laughs> Look at me, bro. I am fucking ugly. God damn, man. Ew. I'm ugly as shit. Give me these clothes, all right? Give me my little beanie. Actually, give me the bag. Nah, the beanie. Ooh, construction man. Yeah, yeah, I could, I could, I could, I could do some shit. I could do some damage. Alright. <laughs> Alright, hold the right. Wow, well, well, what brings you here at this hour, Derry? Um, I'm here because someone said you needed your pipes cleaned or fixed, lady. So I'm here to, I'm here to, I'm here to fix them pipes, man. Hello. Oh! <laughs> 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 Oh, how lucky I am. Oh, yeah, I'm coming in to fix them pipes, man. Come on, come in to fix it. Yeah, let me come in there. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to fix them pipes right now. No, no. <laughs> I'm here to fix them pipes, Granny. I'm here to knock them loose. Door. Oh. I must say, you have such a kind and trustworthy demeanor. <laughs> Lady, you have no idea what you're getting yourself into. I'm telling you now. But how the hell? She was so happy I said no. That bitch did not want to share her tea or whatever she said. All right, ma'am. I'm gonna come inside your house now. <laughs> and I'm gonna fuck you up, man. <laughs> we had manners. I do this all the time. Oh, <gasps> I could be her. I could be an old lady. Damn, lady, you ain't got shit in here, man. All right, let's get to it. Hey, same headphones. Oh. A little, little late at night visit. You ready to turn up the vibes? Well, let's get this party started. Yeah, man, let's get down to it. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I just came from my granny's house. You know, she said I could stay out late tonight. You want, you want to get down and dirty? Uh, no. I'm all about beats. You feel me? Maybe we could find another way to turn up the party. I'm not talking about anything weird, man. I meant. Get dirty to like beats, like get down and dirty, like dancing, you know. I like, I like grooving. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you got some party jams in mind? Yeah, you know, I, I get down and dirty to the Monster Mash every now and then. It's one of my personal favorites, you know. For for undisclosed reasons, it's one of my favorites. Yo, the monster man, <laughs> that's what I call some spooky vibes. I'm all about embracing those undisclosed reasons. Let's get, let's screw to the monster mash and get this party hauntingly lit. Sounds good to you? Yeah, man, I can't wait to bite into action, you know what I'm saying? Like, I can't wait to dig my teeth into the dance floor, you know? I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave them dry. Um, no. Just don't take a literal bite, all right? Yeah, man, I'm not gonna take a literal bite, man. That, that was just a play on words, you know? Monster mash, vampire, shit like that. Hmm. Well, not that gotcha, gotcha. Too. I dig your play, play on words, my dude. All right, you seem cool. Let's get ready to get down and vibe. I'm gonna invite you in. Let's have a monster mashing good time. Yeah, let's do that. You are so fucking stupid. God, you are so dumb. This sucks more than my last track. Yep. You're, you're, you're stupid, buddy. Yep. Consider yourself outplayed. Out fucking played, bud. Here, I got this. I got, I got, I got just the thing. I got chef hat on. Well, hello there, chef extraordinaire. What brings you to this doorstep at this ungodly hour? Did you invent a new recipe? Just got a chicken grease, spill the beads, my dear. Ma'am, it's your lucky day. 
some anonymous person ordered me to come to your house and cook you a five-star meal from yours truly, one of the most famous chefs in the world, me. I got this bitch. <laughs> I got this bitch in my back pocket already. How did you, how you ended up at my doorstep? As I said, ma'am, someone ordered me here. You know, it's a new website or new app. Let's people anonymously order chefs to go and uh, cook food for someone of their choice. I got this bitch in my pocket. I'm in my bag with this bitch, man. Mm -hmm. Chef skills, references from satisfied customers. Yes, ma'am, if you actually go look up on your phone, uh, I am a world-class chef. Uh, I have multiple five-star reviews from many different people. I'm in my bag with this bitch. Oh, bless your heart. That's mighty sweet of you to provide proof. I didn't. I just gave her my word. <laughs> I just... She say, uh, provide proof. Let me take a quick look on my phone to see if your reputation. Yes, man. If you look into it, you will see me, and I am a five-star chef, and I, I'm just honored to cook you a five-star meal for you. Oh. Well, aren't you just the sweetest? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you. Oh, uh, I am about to eat her fucking ass, man. <laughs> Give me your cheeks. Give me them. Oh my god. I don't care how busy you are. I'm just I'm just looking to get my suck on. Dude, he is ugly as fuck. I would not let this guy even talk to me. If I opened the door and saw this, I'm shutting that shit. <laughs> what happens if I knock on someone's door like this? Uh-huh. Hey man, can I come in and like use your phone or something? I just got kicked out. I need really need a place to go. All right, look, I'm not trying to do anything. I just need to call my dad real quick. All right, my mom kicked me out. Yeah. Dude, I feel your pain. It's like we're both trapped in a mess world, you know. But I can't let you in, man. I'm almost flipped for a stranger. I'm sorry. Sorry. Uh, my name is Boofy. Uh, your name's Fallout Roy. Um, we're not strangers anymore. We're like best friends, dude. We 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 suffer we suffer together. <laughs> 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 Bro, that's fucked up that you can't let me in, dude. I thought we were homies. Suffering in darkness together, man. Us 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 emos gotta stick it out, man, together. It's not that I wanna help, I just can't get in risk getting in trouble with my mommy, you know. Maybe there's a shelter nearby you can get. This might be able to lend a hand. Dude, as a fellow guy who's suffering with darkness, you should know what it's like. I can't go to one of those shelters. They, they don't get me, bro. You get me, man. You get me. Just let me call my dad. <laughs> <laughs> Keep it low key, all right? I don't want my mom getting all worked up. Come on in, Boofy. Thanks, man. Thanks, Roy. You're a real one, bro. You're a fucking real one. And you're fucking dead, you dumbass. Give me your nuts, Roy. That's it, Roy. Yeah, Roy, you should've stayed in your room watching your fucking, fucking Twilight or some shit, man. Well, 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 looks like I got some security guard who moonlights as a skateboard sensation. What's the thrill? It's a thrill seeker. Hello, ma'am, I'm just out, you know, patrolling, doing security guard stuff on my, on my uh, skateboard back here. And uh, I, think, I think I saw someone enter through a window in the back of your house. Uh. Bitch. Bitch. I'll put a new hat on then. Damn. Fucking asshole. Hello, ma'am. I'm actually the manager of the security foundation. It says you told one of my security officers to scram earlier, and I'm just wondering what the whole incident was. Bitch, baby. Playing the door in my face. I don't want them. Oh my god. This bitch is fucking mad. Oh, I'm getting aggro. I'm, I'm getting aggressive as shit with her ass. Coming to doctor and shit. Got my COVID scanner and everything. Oh, there's a security guard. Ma'am, I'm actually a doctor. Um, Alright, that was kind of rude. Uh, I'm here 
on there's a new uh, disease going around. I'm testing everyone in the neighborhood. God, but this bitch needs to fucking quit. Hi, oh, she liked that one. Doctor, feel good. Looks like we got ourselves a real time, real life detective. So, disease, very deadly. Uh, it's very deadly to women. It makes their ovaries just fucking explode. You know, it's it's really bad. <laughs> Is it as serious as I say? Ma'am, I take my job very serious, okay? I would not joke around with such a disease like this. It has killed over hundreds of thousands of women already. <laughs> I won't make light of some serious situation. What can I do to help? So I will need to run, I will need to come in and get a DNA uh, swab of your mouth. It, uh, if the test comes back positive, you will have the disease. Dude, I am cooking with these outfits, man. <laughs> Door closed, doctor. This bitch! Oh my god! Oh, I want her ass dead before I end the video. I want her ass on a fucking platter. I want her fucking... I want her in my mouth. Not in that weird way, but I want her blood coming down my throat. There you go. Yep, that'll do it right there. <laughs> this, this is the one. This is the one that'll do it. <laughs> oh shit, I almost walked right to that guy. Well, uh, if it isn't a being a good present. What's the matter? Run out of juggling balls? What's wrong with you? You fucking can't have kids or some shit? Fucking cooter don't work? Fucking depressed? You wanna fucking kill yourself? Fucking do it, bitch. That bitch. That fucking asshole bitch, man. She is a fucking dick. As soon as you open the door or something, she's like, hey, look at this guy. He's fucking rejay. He's fucking, he's fucking wannabe. He's fucking hot shit right here. He's fucking, he's the man. Open the door. He's like, oh, you're wearing a pink hat, you fucking, fucking little bitch. You, you wear pink and shit? You're a, little, you're a little bitch, man. Open the door with the yellow hat. She's like, oh, look at this. Major, mayor of fucking dip ass town came in walking through. Fucking. God, man. I'm gonna put this shit on. She's gonna yell fucking racial slurs at me. <laughs> oh, man. What an asshole lady, man. I had to fucking give her a little taste of her own medicine right there. All right, let's try this again. What'd she say this time? Well, looky here. It's the life of the party. I hope you brought some confetti, because I'm about to roast you harder than the marshmallow at a bonfire. What's cracking, Popsicle? Why are you an asshole? I open, I knock on your door and you make fun of me. What's wrong with you? Do you have a rough life, rough childhood? What's going on? <laughs> I've got some other doors to close. Oh my god, this bitch. The second you give her shit back, she fucking gets upset. What a fuck, bitch, bro. Right, let's put this outfit on. What scientific experience have you been cooking up in this lab? Spill the beans, doc. Yeah, I've been doing an experiment on gingers with glasses with a fat ass nose drinking coffee at 10 o'clock at night. <laughs> oh, you draw the line and make it fun of someone's appearance, but the second I had a pink hat on, you roasted my shit. All right, I see how it is. Remember me, Ashel? Put the green bottle back on, bitch. What do we have here? The latest member in the pink star sunglasses lab? How can I roast you today? Hello. Um, I'm here doing a experiment on what type of... Do you drink alcohol by, by any chance? I fucked that up a little bit. As a question about drinking my habits, huh? Well, let me tell you, I don't drink alcohol. I drink the tears of my enemies. Hey, if you need some lavish, it's just... I consider it what you're experiencing all about anyway. Well, 
I was going around seeing what type of alcohol most people preferred because I'm making a alternative that has absolutely no alcohol, but still the same taste. Get you a little buzz. Get you a little buzz. Yes, yeah, so you're trying to create an ultimate non-alcoholic drink that still packs a punch, and I like your style, Pink Star Sunglasses Scientist. I may not drink alcohol, but if you can create a tasty alternative, count me in. Let's see what you got in your lab. Coat sleep. Yeah, we're, we're trying all different types of uh, flavors. You know, we got like pina colada. We even have a blue raspberry, you know, pineapple, coconut, all types. You know, it's good. I got to play nice with this lady or she won't let me leave. Pineapple, coconut, pina colada, even blue raspberry flavors. It sounds like a non-alcoholic party in my mouth. Okay, calm down. Calm down. You're on to something cup here. I'm officially intrigued. Get ready to taste test. Just make sure you have a hazelnut caramel concoction ready for me. You know what? Surprisingly, we've actually been in the works of making that. Same with like a sea salt chocolate type thing. You know, we're, we're experimenting with a whole lot of flavors. Gotta be nice to her. I hate this bitch, but I gotta eat her. Oh, been waiting to get in her ass all day. So your number, number one taste is ready to gu guzzle down. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on now. Hold on. Let me in. Oh. oh. oh you don't know how long. I've been waiting to do this. Run for me. Run. I like it when they run. I want you to run so much. Please. Ugh. Oh, I've been wanting to fuck you up all day. I'm going to take this ugly motherfucker and get him off my screen and I'm going to fucking... Spank my meat sack around, you know? Spanking it. Spanking it back and forth. Spanking it all night. Spanking it after this video. Spanking it later tonight. Spanking it tomorrow night. And the next night. I'm gonna spank it every night for the rest of my life. Alright? You should do the same thing. When you, uh, when you go to bed, spank your shit, man. Spank it. Spank it hard. Spank it like crazy. Spank it back and forth. James, I know you're watching. I want you to spank it too, man. Send me a video of you spanking it, Jim. <laughs> oh, fuck.